Hi, and welcome to this edition of Take Home Crafts from the Bettendorf Public Library. Today we are going to make a, a, a super cute um, sewing kit made out of a glass jar, some material scraps, polyfill, have a little bit of craft, craft glue here, and a mini sewing kit. Um, that is what is included in your kit. You may also want to have something like a Q-tip to spread your glue. Um, and I have also included a few things from my original sewing kit at home that I would like to put in my kit. Of course, that's totally optional. Um, here's what I have. Our first step is going to be to take our lid off of our jar. So I'm going to unscrew that and then you have this lid that um, you pop off. Okay. Um, so I'm going to set my jar aside for the moment. I'm going to separate these two items. And then um, I'm going to flip my fabric over and I'm going to grab my polyfill. And then I'm going to wrap my polyfill into my fabric like this. And then I'm going to place it on top of my jar lid. Then going to wrap my fabric around it and flip it around. Okay, I'm going to make sure everything fits. Um, if I wanted to add a little more polyfill, I could. If I have it, if it's a little too big to, to fit, I can also take some out. My next step is going to be to glue my fabric onto the back of my lid. And I've got my lid setting on the polyfill. So I'm going to take my Q-tip that I'm using for my uh, craft glue and I'm going to put some right on there. Okay, that's just my first step. Oops, it's kind of tricky there. my fingers on that while I let that dry for a moment. I just let this dry for a moment or so. I pressed my fingers into it um, just so that it will hold. It is a pretty tacky type of glue so it should hold. Um, the next part is I've got to kind of clean up these corners. So again I'm going to add some more glue and I'm going to press that in. Hold for a moment. And I'm going to do the same thing on my other four corners. So I've been pressing and holding this for about one moment or so um, to make sure that it sticks. Um, so when you turn it over this way, it looks like a little soft pillow. This is also going to be your pin cushion at the top if, if you are, would like a pin cushion. Now I'm going to fit my pin cushion or my top of my uh, sewing kit into the ring here. Okay, I'm gonna set that aside for a moment. It's now time to fill your sewing kit. So we have this um, cute little mini sewing kit uh, right in your take home craft kit for you. Again, if you have other things um, that are sitting around in a sewing kit that you have, like I said, this, this was my prior sewing kit, but I think this one is so much cuter. Um, I'd actually like to sit it out and display it where I have kept my other one just inside my drawer. Um, I put a few um, spools of thread in there. I've got some safety pins. Um, whatever you would like to put in there um, is your choice. Um, and then you will just affix your top of your jar, just like that. Oops, sorry, I'm out of vision right there. Just like that. And then if you would like to, when you are sewing, you can just stick it 
stick your pins or needles right up in there um, for a pin cushion. So thanks for joining us today. There's our finished project. And I hope you've enjoyed um, this edition of Take Home Crafts with the Bettendorf Public Library.